Hello everybody, welcome to the January 2015 Steam Shop Update. We've been busy over the last several months cleaning and updating our shop. Part of that updating involves purchasing new equipment, new tooling, and thousands of parts that we're going to need as we undertake the restoration of not only the UP844 boiler scope project that's underway currently, but eventually the UP4014 rebuild, and eventually beyond that is the UP3985. So on the table here we have a variety of all types of different components and tools that are used in the steam locomotive shop. These are very common back in the boiler shop uh, when steam locomotives were in common use on the Union Pacific Railroad. These boiler tools supported all classes of locomotives today. Uh, today we're dealing with what we call the superpower class, uh, the UP844, the 800s, and the 4000s, and the 3900 class Challengers. So we've got the large tube rollers, and we've got examples of brand new tube rollers that we've obtained in the process of reinforcing all the equipment that we're going to need as we undertake this work. You can see examples of different styles of reamers. A lot of these reamers, uh, this is a new reamer. Uh, that's a spiral flute reamer that we had uh, a few years ago as part of a rivet project that we worked on uh, the UP844 mud ring. And we've got some smaller ones. There's a straight flute. Uh, you can see that uh, these, they've served many, many years. This particular unit probably goes back to the 1930s, maybe even earlier. Uh, we have examples of uh, superheater header bolts. These are brand new, uh, manufactured exactly to the specifications called for on the Union Pacific drawings, along with all the associated hardware, a new nut, beautiful hardware, all heat treated and ready to go. We've got examples of washout plugs. And again, uh, there's a lifespan to all equipment, and this equipment has been in service for many, many decades. Uh, so we've, we've sourced a new supply that we've had made, and that is a new representation of a washout plug. We've got two different styles there. And you can see all the different types of staple sleeves and caps and, and other necessary components for the staples. In addition to the stay bolt sleeve, there's a whole set of installation tools. You've got a seat reamer, which will ream the seat for the correct profile. And there is a guide rod that is installed in here that ensures proper alignment on that stay bolt sleeve prior to it being welded into the sheet. There's also other installation tools, bucking tools, riveting tools, and just a whole array of specialty items that we are having custom made for these jobs. You can see all the different styles of caps. This particular cap was removed recently off the UP844. Uh, that was installed during the 2004 rebuild, and that will be replaced with a new cap. So a lot of exciting work here. Uh, we've got an example of a brand new 80 gun. This is a riveting gun. We've got several of those, plus a larger style. In addition, we've had custom riveting tools made and uh, these were recently used in that riveting project I spoke of before. And over on the far right of the table, we've got brand new, newly manufactured binder bolts. That particular bolt will be for the UP844. We have a complete new set coming for the UP Big Boy. So exciting work out here. Thank you very much for watching.